This event is uh, all about uh, getting girls from all across, all across the province of Nova Scotia together uh, for a weekend of fun, a uh, weekend of meeting new girls, and uh, playing the great game of hockey. The festival is, is full pretty much every year. We take about 400 kids. Uh, in fact, Friday morning I registered, uh, the, I think it was 396, <laughs> number 396 on Friday morning. Uh, there's been uh, a bit of growth at uh, the IP level who you see playing here behind us. Uh, we've got about 20 or 25 uh, more kids this year than in previous years, uh, which is great because this is where they all start. Um, it's like a tournament for girls almost, like, I don't know, it's really fun. So they take a bunch of girls and put them all on teams and stuff like that. Um, and you meet a lot of new people. Uh, it's fun. I like uh, playing with other girls. And I like how it's not meant to be competitive and it's just for fun. So I'm one of the uh, head coaches for one of the uh, IP or five-year-old groups in Cole Harbor. So myself, uh, basically, uh, a co-ed of five and six year olds. It's a great opportunity for all the girls just to play with other girls from around the province at the same skill level. With just girls, they've got some of the uh, older girls on the ice as well helping out. It's just really to promote uh, uh, females in sport and give a really good equal opportunity just, just with themselves. A lot of friendship, camaraderie. Really it's just a fun and to really let them enjoy playing hockey. I have uh, two daughters that are actually playing, so I'm helping to coach. I coached in Cole Harbor during the year, and I have one girl that's uh, four turning five, and I have another girl that's six. Yeah, Caitlin's actually, she is only four years old. I think she's the youngest one on her team, and uh, she, she's, uh, it's great to just see how much she improved during the year, and uh, she loves coming out. She's, uh, she always, you can probably see the smile on her face right now. She's had a big smile uh, all throughout the year and the different jamborees we've had so I think that's what as a parent that's the most important thing that you can see is that your your kid is having a good time and they have a smile on their face. Love to see the smiling faces that's that makes it all worthwhile there's uh, there's not, nothing like seeing a you know a five or six year old kid there with with a grin from ear to ear. They're having a really good time they uh, I think they really enjoy playing with the other girls. Usually they're kind of outnumbered a lot of times during the year with uh, more boys than girls, but I think they really, they're really enjoying seeing other girls in the dressing room and, and seeing some of their friends and uh, just having fun. Well, it's actually um, a good thing. Like, it's a good opportunity for us because I'm from Cape Breton, so I get to go up and travel up to Halifax for an all-girls tournament. Well, I think it's good because all girls from like double A, A or um, house could like come and just play with all girls. It doesn't have to be like, you don't have to be a certain level. Oh, it's pretty friendly. I mean, it's not the most serious tournament in the world, but I mean, it's fun too. They don't really keep score on the scoreboard, but we kind of keep score, you know, in our own little world. The seasons for them are sometimes competitive. This, this event is all about just playing for fun. Uh, we don't post any scores up on the boards for any of the games. Uh, normally run a buzzer to, for the girls to, to change shifts. So like, you know, it's, it, it's all about the enjoyment of the game. Well, we had a skill development yesterday after our first game. So that was pretty good. We just worked on some like edge edges, and we did some um, chasing, like chasing and coming up and passing it. We have uh, three games where we teach some positioning and stuff, uh, some moving the puck, just generally going for the puck. And then there was some skills building yesterday at a practice where we worked on some skating, turning, uh, skating with the puck passing, a lot of fun stuff. They played a little hand soccer, uh, did some stuff with some tag, with some 
inflatable, or not inflatable, but foam swords, just to get them moving, lateral movement and stuff. It's a great festival. I mean, it's, you learn how to play with a team that if you're a girl, it's just play with girls instead of playing with your regular team. I mean, you make, a, you make a lot of new friends, like you meet a lot of new people because they take people from a lot of different places. I just think that the best thing is I, everyone's having fun, really. And we all get to go out and share something that most people don't usually get to do. I mean, most of my friends are playing the festival right now. Um, but next year, I hope all my friends are playing.